Okay, so what's up guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, after contemplating for like literally ever, I finally, 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 finally decided to order my open flash tablet. And after waiting for three weeks, it's finally here. So, I'm gonna open it. I'm so excited. So, I actually... I don't think this is supposed to be this hard. Break this thing before it even comes out of the box. this through Sean Yak from Subi Land so okay so what's in this box oh did I open this upside down I'm like so So this is like the actual tablet. It's bigger than I thought it was. I mean, it's not huge, but it's just like, it's bigger than I expected. And then you have the OBD2 port and then your like USB just to plug it into your computer. Okay. And then I 
come back to this. Hmm? Queen of boy. There's a couple of them. <gasps> Is that a Miata? Okay guys, so it's been a couple of days since I did my stage one tune with my open flash tablet. And I kind of just wanted to give like a final review type thing. Um, I kind of did have some, some setbacks. I realized that my exhaust was leaking. So after my car was kind of just running like garbage, basically, um, I literally, the funny thing is, I literally just fixed an exhaust leak and it was perfectly fine. And two weeks later, now I'm leaking again in a different place. So my car is kind of just running like crap. So um, I can't fully say everything that I think about it just until my car is actually running properly. But just a couple of things that I did notice that I'm like super satisfied with. Um, so I don't know if anybody else has this issue i've heard it's pretty common just like the car idling really weird and kind of wanting to stall out whenever you have your ac or your heat on so i can for sure say that the stage one tune did get rid of that for me um and as well as the pedal is a lot more reactive um the car responds to acceleration like a lot more i love that it's almost in a way easier to drive i guess um it also, uh, when I cold start or anything, just in the mornings, like, my idle would be, like, it would be fluctuating, like, up and down, up and down, up and down. It would just, like, run really crappy. It doesn't do that anymore. It runs a lot smoother, other than, like, my exhaust leak right now. I've noticed that it's a lot better as well. Um, I'm not too sure about horsepower, per se. I don't really think it does much. Um, I am feeling like restriction on horsepower right now of course because of the exhaust leak but other than that i'm pretty satisfied with it and i'm sure it'll run like 10 times better once i fix the leak um and then as well as yeah but um so i definitely recommend it like <sighs> stage one it's not really gonna do much for you just like the smaller things if you care about the smaller things some people only care about bigger things um i would say it's worth it um, you can also like read check engine lights and, and stuff like that. So it does have more than one um, use. Is that, I think that's, yeah. It has more than, than the ability to just tune. Um, but yeah, I wasn't really planning on, on getting too deep into this car. I just needed kind of like a, a daily um, while I'm sort of in the process of kind of rebuilding my Civic. Um, but I ended up actually falling like way more in love with this car than I expected so yeah now I'm um, here I am but yeah guys thanks for watching um I hope you enjoyed this video and stay tuned for more bye